Here's how to install the Fresh Animations mod from Minecraft 1.21.5. Let's go. All right, so the first step is to click the second link in the description, which will place you right here. In here, we're going to download Fresh Animations. For that, head over to Game Versions and look for 1.21.5. If you don't see 1.21.5, don't worry. You could choose 1.21.4 and download that version because as you will see in this video, it actually works with 1.21.5. Once you selected this version, click on the green arrow right here and the download will begin right away. Now, if you ever installed Fresh Animations before, you know that it also requires a couple other files. We're gonna need to download the EMF or Entity Model Feature mod. For that, click on the third link in the description. That will put you right here. Select the game version 1.21.5. Now, before we go ahead and download one of these three here, you need to check what mod loader you're gonna be using for running this mod on. Are you using Fabric? Are you using NeoForge? Or are you using Forge? Now, if you're not using any of those in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to get Fabric later on. But if you already have one of those downloaded on your computer, just choose the one that works for you, okay? Now, if you don't have any of those, let's go ahead and download the Fabric one. It should be this one right here that says platform fabric click on the green arrow now the last mod that we need to download is the entity texture features mod so it's the same process click on the fourth link in the description select 1.21.5 and just like we did before we're going to download the fabric one unless you have a different mod loader right so go ahead and hit download in there and now we should have three files downloaded in our computer fresh animations emf and etf right go ahead and drag and drop those three files into your desktop the zip file for the fresh animations resource pack, the entity model features, and the entity texture features. Now, if you guys already have a mod loader installed, just add these mods into your mod folder and then load this resource pack into the game. I'm assuming that most of you don't have a mod loader, so that's what we're going to do next. We're gonna get the fabric mod loader. Now, if you click on the first link in the description, you will see this article going here that teaches you step-by-step -step in detail how to get the fabric mod loader installed because I'm gonna go quick in this video and I don't want you guys to feel lost. Anyways, once you're here on this article, just go down to step one and click on fabric that is going to redirect you right here click download universal jar and the fabric installer will download now go ahead and place that fabric installer on your desktop now with the fabric installer in your desktop close your minecraft game as well as your minecraft launcher and double click on the fabric installer once it opens select 1.21.5 and hit install fabric should install super quick and once it's done go ahead and hit ok close the installer and you could now delete that file from your desktop because you don't need it anymore. That should leave you with only these three files which we're going to add to the game next. Go ahead and open your Minecraft launcher. Whenever the Minecraft launcher open, if you install Fabric Loader properly, you should see it selected here as 1.21.5. Even if you don't see it in here, don't worry. The next step is the same for everybody. Head over to installations and in here, make sure you select modded without modded you won't see fabric in here now once you have fabric in here hover over it and click on this open installations folder icon right here that is going to open a folder that contains a lot of files but you're looking specifically for a folder called mods m-o-d-s and if you don't have this mods folder i'm actually going to delete mine if you don't have the mods folder just go ahead and hit new hit folder and name it mods you could create the mods folder yourself now open this mods folder app and drag and drop these two jar files that we have in our desktop that we downloaded earlier just go ahead and place them in here okay the etf and the emf now once you have those files in here go back into this folder back out into the main minecraft folder the one that we originally opened and look for the resource packs folder resource packs right here if you don't have this folder you could create a new folder and name it resource packs but you should usually have this folder by default now go ahead and open this folder app and add that zip file that we downloaded first the fresh animations zip file put it in here now you should have the fresh animations in the resource packs folder you could close out from this folder go back into the launcher and hit play next to the fabric loader now next time you open minecraft you should see that your fresh animations mod is working if this video helped you don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys next time